game devs play games. That's us. If I mean, you probably already know that already, but you know. Hey, Last cool. we left off, <laughs> it was Chris versus the Forgotten One. Well, first it was Chris versus the uh, the Parasite. Then it was Chris versus the Forgotten One, and now. And now since we're, we're over the Empire Strikes Back phase, he's going to go fight a boss he thinks he can actually beat. Well, okay, this isn't necessarily the one that I can beat, but it's the one that I should beat, because here we get our second harpoon. Now, oh, look how shiny it this is. is the boss that I've been hoping to avoid for most of this playthrough, but it's one we have to do. Oh, you got it. Run away. Upper harpoon acquired. Here we go. The Chain Gang. Chain Gang, that's what they're called. Now, I actually really like kind of the design of, of this boss. Oh my god, because look he, at that. He literally is dragging, he's a giant shark that carries, woo, that carries two giant mines behind him. And so the trick with him is we gotta, he's gonna dash at us. So we have to lure him to dash into the mines on his back. Oh. Um, now we don't have to, right? Like. We can actually kill him um, just with our harpoons. It's incredibly inefficient, but it works. Now, the part that I actually really, really despise, and I like, I understand what they're going for with this, is just the onslaught of sharks. The yeah. onslaught. Ugh. Oh my. It's sad they're all that. Actually, I noticed something that I didn't before about how they do their enemies and their bosses. Boom. Boom. So and he gets a went. really, he gets a bloody face and everything. Oh it's my super, god, that's it's so gross and awesome. Right? Isn't and it he satisfying? Eats the other sharks. <laughs> he kind of does. He just ate a shark. He did, but I feel like, oh, he totally does. Oh, he has a lot. He of doesn't life. really go out his out of his way. He's go, he, so they have the enemies go behind the walls in the scenes. Yes, um, which I, I didn't realize that before. I definitely know why like that's necessary because in terms of like they would have had to program the AI for it to oh my God. bounce to, off of it. To bounce off, it would be terrible. It just oh, that it, been... it, it's. I think ultimately what they decided was it was probably just more work than it was really worth when like. Oh God, fucking. Okay, uh... Use your nuclear... We're, we're, we're gonna pause really quick, because I'm turning up the... brightness on this TV. Yeah, it is a little hard to see. Alright. Alright, we're back. So we can see now. Yeah, Better. so... Ugh. So, I actually was going to say, it's not really... I wouldn't call it a technical difficulty, because even when I was playing at my desktop, um, with, like, the computer monitors right in front of me and the gamma all the way up, like, it still was really hard to see these guys. And, like, you can even see, like... Nothing actually changed for you guys watching, but uh, we turned up the brightness on our TV. And, like, you can see, Naven, that, like, even the water's kind of murky, even if, uh, even yeah, with the brightness all the way so up. Yeah, there's so much you can do. So... Uh, how many of these sharks are there? A lot. I, I honestly don't know. All I know is that we have to kill all of them. Um, which I feel like... That's... I feel like it's a one or... One or the other, right? Like, I... If you're gonna give us a giant shark, I feel like as soon as we kill him, it should that should be it. In fact, like I've gotten to the point where I have killed him first, and just had to deal with the um, the onslaught of these other sharks, and still died, even when like they were dwindling in numbers. And it's it's hard, man. Like it, I feel like I should be dying to the giant shark and not the little guys. Yeah, it's more like at this point that he's just a distraction. It is. That's it, that's exactly what it is. So like, I think that impacts the design of this boss battle negatively because it sort of distracts from. It's, it distracts from like the centerpiece of the boss battle, right? Like he yeah. should be the big and and scary and ominous thing, but really it's like I just dodge him and whatever. Like I it's mean, not the even boss that... is called the Chain Gang, so it's about the gangs. That's and that's true. Oh, no. Like I think that's a fair way. Ah, he was so close to being dead. He was. I guess the other way of looking um, at it is I could maybe I could use him to kill some of the other shark, right? Like, yeah. But he only is so effective if you use him that way, and I feel like you're more likely to get killed. I feel like a lot of times he just kind of, like, dawdles around. <laughs> he does kind of dawdle around. I could get closer to him and kind of tempt him, um, but, I mean, I also don't have a dash, so it's pretty easy for him to catch me off guard. Like that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there was a green shark. Did you see the green shark? 
No. Oh, right. You didn't see the green shark. There's a green shark. Am I crazy? I'm pretty sure there's a green. No, I think there. Oh. I think there is. I just may not realize that he's green. I know that there are other colored sharks. I've They're only definitely... seen those same gray ones over and over again, and then that one green one. I don't know. Flavor? Maybe it was RNG. Like there was actually supposed to be a normal mixed assortment, and just like we've been really unlucky. Oh. What just happened? Did the game crash? He hit both of the mines at the same time. Uh, <laughs> that is a really upset looking shark. <laughs> we'll be back, everyone. <laughs> Technical difficulty. <laughs> Did you want to pause the timer? Oh, yeah, there's an error log. Ooh. Fatal error. Action number one. Welcome back uh, again, everybody. Uh, so we got a, an error that uh, was basically saying it cannot render out a, a thing of 98,000 bytes because it exceeded the uh, max allocation. So I think it didn't like uh, two explosions at the same time. No. This is kind of what I'm thinking, uh, which is an unfortunate bug. I feel like that's one where they, they had to have known that was a thing, right? Like, that's like the first thing I would have tested if I were to, to QA this game. Uh, maybe they thought they fixed it and something else happened. Cause like before, when you ran into, uh, when he ran into two explosion, two mines at the same time, one would explode and the other one would just kind of bounce off. As oh, if it gave fair. him invulnerability. Just BS, because we don't get invulnerability. Oh, I bet that totally is a thing, actually. So maybe he just, like, hit them at such a good time. Oh my god, really? I didn't encounter this in my personal playthrough. So... We'll be back. Yep. And we're back. Hey, everybody. Back for another round. We're gonna not let him blow those both up at the same time again. Uh, this was an unexpected obstacle. It's like hit in hard mode where you're not allowed to take advantage of his weakness. <laughs> <laughs> right? There is one other thing, though, that I, I forgot to mention is that if we charge... Ooh, he really did not want me to get God, away. God, man. If we charge the harpoon a little bit, it will go through more than one shark at a time. I just saw that. There was that green shark up ahead. He's gone. Whoop. Now, with that said, the angles are, like, it's hard to get the sharks lined up to where you can get more than one yeah. killed. But there he is, the green oh, one. Totally get is. him, get him, get him, get him. What if he spent, oh, he just got tail swiped by the big shark. Oh, there oh, you go. That's it, you win. <laughs> it's done, did it. Game over. Broke your game. Oh, God. <laughs> with that said, I really like that I can shoot in 360 degrees. Oh, my it's God. really cool. Okay, next time they start to swirl around like that, get out of the ball of death. That's what I try they to tend do. to do a ball of death. Well, here's the thing. I've actually noticed that this battle tends to go a lot easier if uh, you move around less. So if you can get, get into a spot where, like, you can kind of sit idle, see how, like, they stop swarming as much? So the more you move, the more huh. likely they're, a they're going to, like, launch at you. Um, now, it's really easy to get to that point where you're surrounded, and then you just kind of have to flee for your life, and then it's really easy for it to just, like, perpetuate itself, you know? Um, although this time I'm You are almost done bad. with them. Just don't get swarmed again. The, the one nice thing is that they do start dwindling. It's not like there's an infinite amount until they have no health. No, I mean, they have a health bar. Well, like, the way I would have done it if I were to have programmed it, I would have just, like... Um, generated an infinite supply of those sharks until their health is zero, and then there's just none. Yeah. Um, there actually is a tangible... No. There's a tangible amount of sharks in that area. Like, there's always going to start with the same amount, and for every shark that we kill, it makes them that much less. Well, so far, it doesn't seem like they have a problem getting to you, so... The fact that there is a tangible, like an actual tangible amount, I'm not too much against. Yeah, it really, it's only like silly when we're down to the last like one or two and you're just like, where are you? Where are you? You're in a ball of death. Yeah. Now you're dead. Um, but it, it really does get to the point too where it's like, even one of those sharks can kill you. And, uh. You're dead. I'm real dead. You know what? Did it crash again? Oh my god, it did! Well, guys, that's a good time to start the question of the day, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna let you take this one. Uh, alright, question of the day. Let's, you know, let's, I wanna, I wanna, oh, we don't even get to look at the you are dead screen. Okay, uh, I wanna talk about that boss battle. So, 
I'm <laughs> just looking at the white screen. What do you think uh, is a good resolution for the shark swarming? Obviously, like, we, we've, we've come up with a lot of, like, talk about why we think it's kind of not good to have the focus of that battle be, like, the swarm of sharks killing you, um, and how it kind of feels unfair. So, I guess my question is, what would you do to make that, that boss battle feel more fair? Um, whether it's modifying, you know, the big shark or the chain gang, chain gang itself. Um, I'm curious what you guys think of that. The answer is that definitely has nothing to do with the mines. No. That no. crashed again. Yeah. <laughs> no. uh, my vote is something to do with the chain gangs. That's me. My, my vote's more on the, like, temp vulnerability. But we've already talked that one. We have talked about that one. All right, well, thank you for watching, everyone, and uh, we'll see you in the next episode where we actually kill the chain gang, because it's going to happen. That's our theme music. It is. Now it's going to be off with the what you're doing. Oh, uh, my God. It's going to be weird. Bye. Thank you so much. Bye. <laughs>